Paul Gary here with one of the uh, new faces on this Mets roster this season. Today's starting catcher, Omar Narvaez. Omar, thanks so much for joining us. Uh, what's it been like just getting acclimated to a, a new staff, a new team here, and having to do it in a, a quick fashion before you leave for the WBC? It's been pretty fun, you know, to, um, get to know all these guys and, and finally get to play with them. And, you know, um, not easy to face all these guys, and now I can be on the same team. So it's pretty exciting. I'm looking forward to uh, half a good season. When you say that it's not easy facing these guys, what have you noticed now being on the other side, receiving some of them that's, uh, that stood out to you? I mean, just the mentality that they have, you know, um, this is a winning mentality. We don't, um, we don't think we're just going to be ahead. We're just going to win. Um, whatever it takes to win, we're going to do it. What did you see out of Scherzer today? He was pretty fun, you know. He was throwing a lot of strikes. And he was mixing a lot. Um, you know, it's, no. your search has been searcher. You know, there's nothing, nothing new. Um, just competitive guy. See Francisco Alvarez throwing some seeds your way here. Is that allowed? I mean, you're the veteran. He's he's the young guy. He's the rookie. Let's do something. Let's call him. Where is he at? Oh yeah, ven acá, ven. Ven acá, ven acá. Ven acá. Ven acá. So now we got a ninja. Now we got both of them. Is this allowed for? Oh, <laughs> who's coming now? Is this allowed, Francisco, for you as a rookie to throw seeds at, at the veteran? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's going he's gonna to have some consequences tomorrow morning. <laughs> For air, are we allowed to say what those consequences will be? Not yet. <laughs> I would I would think about it today. You'll see tomorrow morning. What has it been like for you getting to work with with you know Alvarez just here in, in the early going? It's been pretty fun, you know. Um, I didn't know this guy until I got here, and then uh, I was asking a lot when I got. Um, everybody told me a good thing about him, so. Uh, you know, I, I had the time to work with him, and, and it's been pretty fun. It's, it's been pretty a pleasure to try to, you know, teach everything I got. I remember back in the day when I got uh, Giovanni Soto on my side, he did the same thing for me. So I was thinking, why wouldn't uh, I do the same for this guy? He's going to be a superstar at some point. So it's going to be a pleasure to see him on TV being a superstar that I, I thought it would be. Francisco, what have you taken away in the early going from him? I um, he's been uh, really grateful since uh, the first day I got here. Um, I, I teach him and I help him out with everything I know, so he's been pretty pleasure. That's pretty good for you. Look at this multi-talent right now. To translate Francisco's answer mid-interview, you're going to get Alan Suriel out of a job here. You know that, right? My English now, I no English, nothing. I think it was pretty good. We spoke the other day. It's getting there. It's <laughs> Thanks so much, Francisco. Omar, you know, we were talking about um, what you've seen with some of these other pitchers. What is the process as a new catcher with a new pitching staff, just getting to, to know them both personally and their repertoire, what you guys want to do out there? I think uh, once we, we get into the same plan, it's going to be, everything's going to be so easy. You know, a little bit when, when everything gets uh, out of hand, that's when we kind of, not um, synchronize everything on the same pl in the same plan and the same page also. So I think long as everything is in the same page, long as we talk about it and um, it's not pulling to you know any any way is all, all pulling to this Mets way. And I think you know every every guy in this on this clubhouse wants to win. So it's it's not a it's not something that is going to be so hard because all of us want to win, so we're going to do our best to, to compete and win. What about for you personally, your growth defensively? You used to be known as a, a hit first, hit only offensive catcher, and you've really turned yourself into a, a, a solid, above average defensive catcher. What's been the biggest area of growth in the last few years for you? I think my receiving is, is uh, something that I really improved a lot. and. You know, um, calling the game, trying to be understandable. Everything, everything matters. Every pitch matters. And, you know, it doesn't matter if my guy meets a, a pitch. I can still use it of my advantage. So um, I don't, I don't really, I don't really like. You know, I've, if we 3-0, I'm, I'm still gonna attack. So um, 
I feel like um, being behind there is a word, every single at bat, every single pitch. So I'm going to make every every pitch uncountable for us. What do you do specifically to work on receiving? We hear that all the time. I'm getting better at my receiving. What type of specific work did you do to improve? I tried a lot of stuff. <laughs> so um, What worked? Yeah. So basically what we did, you know, in the last couple of years was obviously watching a lot of videos and um, who I like, who I identified as a catcher, who was the most impressive guy for me to try to copy. Then just Who was that? On that time it was Roberto Perez, okay. you know, because uh, on that time uh, we used to play in the same division, so I, I got to see him, uh, see him a lot. So I actually was spoken to him, and one of the things is just be behind the ball as long as possible, and under the ball as uh, long as possible, and uh, just trying out different things. Everything worked out, everything that in sync with my body, and basically that, that, that was the biggest thing that I, that I did. So be under the ball so that you can catch it coming up into the zone and frame it. Yeah. Right. Omar, appreciate the time so much, and thanks so much for translating as well for Francisco Alvarez. All right, we'll talk to you soon. You're welcome. Thank All right, you. guys, back to you.